In this video, I'm going to share with you what kind of salaries aerospace engineers can expect to earn in 2019. We will go over how much aerospace engineers earn today, the five best places in America for aerospace engineers, in my opinion, and how aerospace engineering pay stacks up against some of the other engineering fields. Coming up. Hey everybody, Stephen Hack here, and this is Career Watch, where we cover career trends. If you end up enjoying this video, you can support us by subscribing. Aerospace engineers design aircraft, spacecraft, satellites, and missiles. In addition, they create and test prototypes to make sure that they function according to design. Within aerospace engineering, there's two major and overlapping branches, aeronautical engineering and astronautical engineering. Often, aerospace engineers specialize in areas such as aerodynamic fluid flow, structural design, guidance, navigation, robotics, propulsion, and more. Without further ado, let's get into the salary statistics. In the year 1999, aerospace engineers on average were making $64,550. By the year 2018, aerospace engineering pay had risen to $117,100. So after crunching the numbers, aerospace engineers on average have earned $52,550 over a period of 20 years. This comes out to a gain of about $2,600 every year. So aerospace engineers are making $2,600 on average every single year. So right now the government doesn't release the 2019 numbers yet, but we can project that aerospace engineers will make $119,727 on average in the year 2019. For more information on the history of pay for aerospace engineers, here's a graph showing their pay over the past 20 years. So that is the average pay for aerospace engineers, but here's the thing. Aerospace engineers are compensated very differently depending on where in the country they live. For example, an aerospace engineer in Jacksonville, Florida makes on average $99,450 in the year 2018, which is $17,650 less than the national average. I have compiled a list of the five best metro areas that I believe are really, really great for aerospace engineers. And this is based off two variables, number of jobs and pay. I didn't really get too much into cost of living. so. In my opinion, you know, if there's only 10 jobs in a certain metro area, it's just really, really competitive. So I kind of went for bigger metro areas where there's thousands of jobs and high pay. So without further ado, let's get into the top five metro areas for aerospace engineers. Number five on my list is the metro area of Huntsville, Alabama. And the reason I put this on the list is look at how many jobs Huntsville, Alabama has. Over 3,000 jobs for such a tiny metro area. And the pay's pretty good. It's about $1,000 over the national average, which is not bad. But the reason it's on here really is that just that there's so many jobs, pretty low cost of living. So that's the reason why I put Huntsville, Alabama as the number five spot on this list. Number four on my list is the Denver metro area. There's over 3,000 aerospace engineering jobs. The pay is $128,320 per year, which is $11,000 over the national average. And Denver is a pretty good balance be between having a high number of jobs, pretty solid pay, and relatively lower cost of living compared to some of the big cities like San Francisco and New York City. So number three on my list is the Baltimore metro area. There are 630 jobs according to the government and the pay is $131,110 on average in that metro area, which is 14,000 over the national average. And Baltimore again is not not nearly as expensive as its sister city uh, in Washington DC. It's not as expensive as New York and some of the West Coast cities. So it's pretty good value. There's not quite as many jobs as Huntsville and Denver, but it does have a very high pay relative to the average. The number two metro on my list is the Washington DC metro area. There are over 2,500 jobs and the pay is the highest for all metros for aerospace engineers, $136,720, which is almost $20,000 over the national average. Now, DC is not a cheap place, uh, but if you think about it, DC is extremely close to Baltimore. It's a 40 minute drive from Washington DC to Baltimore. So some people live in between both those metro areas and you can have access to a lot of jobs that way. So high pay, high number of jobs, the Washington DC and Baltimore areas are pretty good spots for aerospace engineers. So number one on my list is the Los Angeles metro area. 
And there are over 4,000 jobs, 4,350 4, jobs in Los Angeles. This is more than any other metro in the United States. So this is one of the best places for aerospace engineers in the country. The pay is 100, the average pay is $133,580, which is a little less than DC. So they're really almost even in my opinion, Washington DC and LA. I just gave LA a little bit of a bump just because there's so much more opportunity in LA than DC. The 2,500 jobs in DC is very strong too. So has about $16,480 over the national average for the average pay. And so that's my number one pick for aerospace engineers. So those are my picks for the best metro areas for aerospace engineers. I tend to be a little bit more job and wage focused, but uh, I didn't really get too much into cost of living for those different metro areas. You'd really have to do a little bit of math to determine, you know, which place you're going to be making the most money. Are you trying to buy a house in a certain area? Are you trying to rent? What your goals are it could be very different for you so let me know in the comments below what what you think about that finally let's compare aerospace engineering pay with some of the other engineering fields now the bureau of labor statistics breaks engineering into 17 different fields and there are more there are subcategories of engineering but the government really settled on 17. so based off those 17 different fields these are the five highest paying engineering fields Aerospace engineering is the third highest paying among them. Petroleum engineers earn the most money, computer engineers are in the number two spot, and aerospace engineering is the third highest of 17 different engineering fields. Are you interested in becoming an aerospace engineer? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, you can support us by subscribing, and I will see you next time.